How's it going, everyone? They actually have, like, a playable gun game mode. Okay, hold on. They actually don't even have one in, like, the regular playlist. Whatever, I'm just happy that there's, like, an actual way to play gun game right now. Because I love gun game, but I don't know. I've been getting owned in gun game, though. I can't lie. But whatever, that's not the point of the video. Uh, how far am I? Jesus. I'm not playing this. Hell no. Give me, a, give me a better game. I was just in a pretty solid game. I was still getting owned, but like not as much like the other games I've played today. I don't know. Hopefully I can get back in that one, but I, I, I doubt it. That's just how matchmaking works, really. What? I swear that was a better game. I'm like, early. Why can't you just put me in that one? It lit I literally... I very clearly just left the game as soon as I joined. Why would it put, why would it, put it back? What? I'm, I'm tired. It is now official. Well, I can't really say it's official because it hasn't been like officially revealed But like a ton of like reliable outlets and stuff like sources I've been claiming that Call of Duty 2023 or Treyarch's next game like after Modern Warfare 2 as it pushed back to 2024 Why is it time out? What? Well, this game has been acted up all day. There's only five players. Oh my okay Won't well, we just happen to be right behind me. How would I have possibly known that? I just completely missed them. All right, well, shout out to aim assist, I guess. Like, I got owned. They have a bunch of reliable sources. I think Bloomberg reported on it first, and then Charlie Intel announced it. 2023 is going to be skipped. It does mean that when the game comes out, it, it, it's, it's, it's going to be a really good game. At least I hope so. If, it, if it's a bad game, I swear. But I think this gives, like, a better chance of it being good. I mean, look at Black Ops Cold War. When it first launched, they had, like, a ton of issues. People hated the game. But now it's, like, fully finished. I mean, it's actually pretty great. I haven't played that much because I don't have a good controller for my PC and I don't have, like one of those wireless adapters. Don't have it on Xbox, but it, it, it's really good. It's usually one of my favorite Call of Duty's of all time. I have so many good memories of it. This also, however, means that we're just gonna have to pray that Modern Warfare 2 is actually gonna be good. Because if it's trash, then we're gonna be stuck with a trash Call of Duty game for two years. And I, I don't know, if, I don't, know, I don't know if I'm okay with that. I think that'd be kind of that kind of suck. I, I'm gonna keep it a stack. Wow, that guy just got so lucky. Jesus. This is also kind of bad news for the competitive community because that does mean that. I mean, Infinity Ward have been like historically one of, if not the worst, like for competitive. Like, Modern Warfare 3 Shep just didn't ship with LAN, first off. And now they're going to be stuck with an Infinity Ward game for two years. So it has to be good, basically, or else they're kind of screwed. I genuinely wonder how they're going to handle this. Like, are they going to have like one massive update in the middle of the in the middle of the two years or are they gonna just slowly update it like usual because honestly i don't know like, how they could really do that i don't know i just hope the game's gonna be good honestly i've heard good things about it like all the all the leaks say good stuff i mean also all the leaks said good stuff about vanguard and now it's kind of mid i wouldn't say it's bad but it's mid it's, it's just it's just pure mid it's not bad or anything I, I i like playing it every once in a while it's just mid like there's nothing special to it you know Trying to... Gas on worked out. I'll take it. No, my... Uh, trigger finger, please. Or lack thereof! That guy's at 1 HP. Oh my god, he's probably like... Okay, thank goodness he didn't fully heal. Oh my goodness. He's probably raging right now. He should have totally killed me there. Shame, shame he didn't, because he's ass. <laughs> Bro, I don't know what it is. My... Aim has been trash in Black Ops 4 recently, but my like movement is like super cracked. I can I can move around, I can like dodge all I want, but like I, I just for some reason all my aim is gone. I really hope that the next game is gonna run the same as like Black Ops 2, like near future, you know? Like not future to, to the point like jetpacks. Like I'd love to see jetpacks again, but that's not gonna happen for like years. But I'd love to see Black Ops 2 era again. I think that'd be so cool. I got it was so strange. Okay. I haven't used like knife. Oh my god, really? That's how I die? For all that, and I just died at the end. I really hope I got at least kill cam, because I don't, I don't want to. Oh my god, and it's, it's such a nerd. Also, Kanye dropped Donda too, kind of. He did a listening party where like the audio got like mega bucked out, and it was just like something else, really. The visuals were really dubbed though, like the sound, the music sounded awesome. He already dropped the album on like the template where I said, but like only four songs. So, yeah, I think it's like slowly rolling it out, which, I mean, I don't know. I'm not a fan of that. I don't know what I'm talking about, Kanye. It's a Call of Duty video. Thanks for watching.